I mean, it should have been there. That's their own stupidity. I mean, darkness may be the absence of light, but stupidity in this instance is the absence of me. All right, Catherine, I'm going to have to let you go. I have students in my office. Yeah, students, undergrads. I don't know, but from the looks of it, they want to sell me a fucking Brooks Brothers franchise. All right, bye-bye. Good morning. Morning. My name is Cameron Winklevoss, and this is my brother, Tyler. And you're here because... Either of you can answer. I'm sorry, I thought you were reading the letter. I've already read it. Well, me and my brother had an idea for a website called Harvard Connection. We've since changed that name to Connect You. And Mark Zuckerberg stole that idea, and I don't... I understand that. I'm asking what you want me to do about it. Well, sir, in the Harvard Student Handbook, hmm. which is distributed to each freshman, it clearly states in the heading Standards of Conduct at Harvard and the subheading Honesty, that this college expects students to be honest in their dealings with members in this community. People must be honest and forthright about their property and private property. And Yes, sir? Come punch me in the face. Please. Any unauthorized use will result in immediate action and terminology of your stay at the university. So you memorize that instead of doing what exactly? What my brother and I are here to say, Sir, with respect, it's against university rules to steal from another student. You've Plain spoken. And simple. Have you spoken to your housemaster? Yes, our housemaster put a recommendation into the board of ads, and the board of ads denied us. Hmm. And you've tried dealing with the student directly. Mark Zuckerberg has not answered the phone or email for two weeks. We tried knocking on his door, and he hasn't been there. I haven't seen him face to face since I ran into him in the quad and chased him down the you square. You chased him? Yes. I know that he saw me, and I saw him. I went after him, and he disappeared. All right, boys, I'm going to be frank with you. I don't see this as a university issue. I disagree. This is exactly a university issue. There's a student code of conduct and a student handbook, and, and Mark Zuckerberg, he disobeyed both of those. You entered into a code of ethics with the university, not with each other. I'm sorry, sir, but I have to disagree with you. You have to disagree with me. Well, that's disappointing. What my brother is trying to say is that if Mark Zuckerberg walked into our apartment and stole our computer, that wouldn't be a community issue? I don't know. This office doesn't usually deal with petty larceny. Petty larceny? Yes. Ty. <laughs> This idea is potentially worth millions of dollars. Millions? Yes. Well, I think you might just be letting your imaginations run away with you a bit. President Summers, I don't think you have any right to be making that claim. I was the US Treasury Secretary. I think I'm in some position to make that claim. Letting our imaginations run away from us is exactly what you outlined in your freshman speech. Well, I suggest you let your imaginations run away with you on a new project. You would? Yes. Everyone at Harvard is always inventing something, because Harvard undergrads believe that inventing a job is better than finding a job. So, my advice to you remains the same, that the two of you should go and find a new, new project to work on. Sir, that's not the point. Please, arrive at the point. <laughs> it doesn't take a property expert to understand the difference between right and wrong. And you think I don't? Uh, of course, that's not what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. Really? All right, Anne. How did they get this appointment? Colleagues of their father. Hmm. Let me tell you something, Mr. Winkleboss and Mr. Winkleboss, since we're on the subject of right and wrong. This action, this meeting, you two being in this office is wrong. It is unbecoming of Harvard, and it is not what Harvard saw in you. You do not get special treatment. We never asked. Just for start any. a new project. If you have like a this problem, is if you have a problem with that, Mr. Winkleboss, we never asked. The courts are treatment. always at you your disposal. You can take disposal. that handbook and shove it. Ty, up. is there anything else I can do for you, Mr. Winkleboss and Mr. Winkleboss? Thank you for your time, sir. The door is there. Please. 